Hello folks, Team Unity here with the Capcom recap for March 20th, 2015. Settle in as we recap what's been going on with us and you over the last couple of weeks. Peter, what's been going on with Street Fighter? Well, at the recent South by Southwest Invitational, there was a match between Razor Xi'an and EG's K-Brad in which Xi'an got a double perfect. Ooh. After he lost the first round, he came back with the Fury and smoked up K-Brad. And I mean, it, it's crazy because it's already hard enough to get a perfect on somebody, let alone a double perfect. But when it's on one of the players who's considered one of the best in the world, mm -hmm. I mean, that's something that's definitely noteworthy. How many so, times do you think that's happened in like the last 10 years? Double perfect? Oh, man. I would say at least twice a month. But anyhow. <laughs> <laughs> anyhow, let me kick it off to Yuri, who's up next, talking about Monster Hunter. So, speaking of feats, uh, Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate has two brand new weapons, but they're also very technical. And uh, the, com ha the community has been pulling off some pretty crazy stunts with them uh, and have put out guides. But you can see here a video from uh, Gaijin Hunter, and it's actually his practice session. So we can see where he makes mistakes, and you can see where he does it just right. So it's a great place to uh, start looking and trying to understand uh, how to perfect your abilities with that weapon. In addition to that, we're also uh, releasing a series of Vine clips with little tips on the game. Follow our Twitter account as well as our Vine account. They're both at Monster Hunter and you'll get little uh, useful tips as well as uh, some pretty hilarious ones. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty hot. Uh, on the Resident Evil front, uh, people have been digging into Revelations 2's you raid mode. Oh, girl. Uh, yeah, so this <laughs> is Gina. She can, uh, with the, via a skill called gesticulation, deal damage with the gestures, of which there are many in the game. Uh, you can see her dancing, prancing, waving. Uh, this is a regular old kick and stab. <laughs> we call that. Uh, but this is the, 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 that's the gold standard there, is Yippie Ki uh, getting in there and doing that damage real quick. But you can level this skill and deal more damage. Uh, it's pretty silly, but um, people have been messing with this. And this is pretty at the, the low end of like you know dealing damage with it, but just the fact that it's possible shows how much fun you can have with raid mode. It's not just running and gunning. It's apparently apologizing and, uh, <laughs> and bowing. Um, but through the skill system, you can actually transfer abilities as well. So in this case, the Samurai Sword, which is for one character, uh, once that level gets to a certain point, you can transfer it to others. So that makes Jill uh, able to wield the samurai sword. And then on top of that, you can stack other abilities that make the knife, or in this case the sword, more powerful, faster. Um, you can stack uh, evasion skills, and you can actually start building character classes almost. So rather wow. than have to just do run, gun, I'm a shotgun mastery, or using uh, using grenade style stuff, you can just do this all melee all the time. Uh, which, again, it's just fun to see how fast people figured this out and started executing it. And you can find a whole bunch of really cool clips of people just tearing through some of the harder levels on raid mode, uh, taking down enemies that you normally thought were way too hard. And on the Devil May Cry front, Michelle Gun 201, one of the best DMC players in the world, brings us another ridiculous video of just him playing the game. This is not a combo showcase you're watching. This is just him playing through uh, one of Virgil's missions. And with DMC Definitive Edition now available on PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, people are digging into that new Gods Must Die difficulty mode. What we're seeing here is a flawless run of the Hunter boss battle. She takes no damage during this whole fight, which is the recommended strategy for Gods Must Die mode. Allegedly, at the time she completed this mission, only 39 people had done so worldwide. Love that parry. It's great. Capcom Recap is a bi-weekly video recap of Capcom news and community feats. Did you do something cool, crazy, or funny in a Capcom game and catch it on video? Email us a video link and a brief description at recap at capcom.com, and it just might end up in a recap soon. Thank you so much! Thank you so much! Thank you so much!